And while the Packers as an organization is helping one Northwoods organization create a new gathering space designed to help celebrate art, culture, and creativity. News Watch 12's Andrew Kikafer explains. Football may not be the first thing that comes to mind when you think about an arts and culture center. However, I am outside at Art Start Rhinelander to find out what they have to do with the Green Bay Packers. Well, who doesn't love getting a letter from the Packers, right? And <laughs> knowing that they're supporting you. So that was pretty cool. The Green Bay Packer Foundation awarded Art Start Rhinelander $3,000 to help fund a future art park. We have not received funding from the Packers Foundation before. We've applied with some other projects, so we were really excited that this one captured their interest. Art Start also received significant funding from Arts Wisconsin and the Rhinelander Community Foundation. Just more of creating this, this um, inspired space for people to come and hang out with. It's a way for us to bring some of the creativity that happens inside our building out into the community. Artists Sarah Thompson, Julie Ryan, and Cold Punches designed the outdoor space. Architectural designer Jennifer Bonardelli took the designs and launched the final vision of the gathering space. Just more of creating this, this um, inspired space for people to come and hang out with. It's a way for us to bring some of the creativity that happens inside our building out into the community. Take a good look at the space behind me because this will be totally reimagined in part thanks to the Green Bay Packer Foundation. Reporting in Rhinelander, Andrew Kikafer, Newswatch 12.